Hello and welcome to another how-to series by Someka. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to create a flowchart on Excel from scratch. After watching the whole video, you're gonna be able to create your own flowchart in Excel. There are four ways we can use to create a flowchart. General Excel shapes, smart art graphics, using add-ins, and Excel templates. Let's start with Excel shapes first. Before we start, I'll set the column width to 2.14, so we can work easily. Let's add multiple shapes so we can create the flowchart. Just click Insert, then click Shapes and you can select the shapes under flowchart section. Let's turn on snap to grid, so we can place the shapes more accurately on Excel. Now we can add arrows. To do that, just select shapes and select line arrows to connect your shapes. Now it's time to add text to each shapes. Just double click on one of the shapes and you can start writing. We can align shapes. And of course, we can customize the shapes by changing the color. Lastly, we can get rid of the grid line for a cleaner look. This is how we create a flowchart with Excel shapes. Let's continue with the second method, Smart Art Graphics. Microsoft Office has pre-made groups of shapes for multiple needs, which are called Smart Art. In the Smart Art, there are also options for flow of chart diagrams. Just click Insert, then Smart Art, and let's click on the Process section. And these are ready-to-use process types suitable for flow charts. Now let's select this one. We can also add additional shapes by clicking the Add Shape button. Let's enter some text on each shape. We can change the color. You can also change the layout here. We can also apply Smart Art styles to change the design of it. And that was the Smart Art Graphics method. Let's continue with the Add-ins method here. Add-ins are extensions that add further options or additional features to Microsoft Excel. For this video, I'm going to use VCO Data Visualizer Add-in. If you don't have VCO, just click Insert then Get Add-ins. Type VCO. And you can click on the Add to add the Microsoft Visio Data Visualizer. Once you add the extension, it will appear on the Add-in section under Insert tab. Let's click Visio Data Visualizer to get started. In here, you can choose the type of diagram you want. Basic flowcharts, cross-functional flowchart, organization chart. Let's start this one for demonstration purposes. It comes with the diagram itself and the sample data table. The table consists of process step ID, process step description, next step ID, connector label, shape type, and alt text. 
You can add or remove as many rows as you like. Let's add another process step. After entering the new step, you can click refresh so the diagram can update itself. We can also change the shape type here. Please note that editing your chart may need a VCO license, which is a separate purchase from Microsoft 365. Let's continue with the fourth method, Excel templates. These are ready-to-use Excel templates downloaded from outside sources. If you don't have time to create a flowchart on Excel or simply want more detailed and professional version, you can download an Excel template. Just go to somicout.net Type flowchart and you can download automatic flowchart maker for free. Thanks for watching.